Imagine you have 100,000 Naira. You can either keep it under your bed, save it in your savings account, or invest it with 15% interest. Which one will make you richer? Guess how much 100,000 Naira will make in three years on 15% with compound interest. Before we calculate, let me ask you this. Do you know how compound interest work? Then stay with me because today I'm going to show you step by step how to calculate compound interest as if you are a baby and anybody can understand this. And I will, I will show you why it's a secret weapon of the rich. We have two types of interest. There's one they call simple interest and there's another one they call compound interest. So simple interest is like one time bonus. The money you get, you know, just one time you invest money and they just give you the interest just once. But there's what they call compound interest. Com in compound interest, that interest they gave you once will start earning another interest. So for the simple interest, your money is only a, your initial capital, initial money invested is the only thing and earning uh, interest. But with compound interest, when the interest accumulate then that interest will start earning another interest think of compound interest like you know planting a tree at first it's small but every year it grows and grows more branches so that's what compound interest is all about it's not just about the initial plant you planted growing this one is it will grow and then it will grow larger then make branches which is the interest that then now earn interest so now let's get to the calculation. You have to use this formula. Here is a normal formula, generally accepted a formula for compound interest. Don't worry, it looks confusing for some people that are not really into mathematics and calculations, but it's really simple. So today I'm going to break it down for you so that you get it. So it's important to know that A, is how much you will have in the future. YP is your starting money, which is the 100,000 Naira. YR is the interest rate. And for the purpose of this video, we are using 15%. And N is how many times the interest is added per year. Let's use one for now, which is one year. So the T is how many years you keep the money. Let's break it down step by step. So now look at this equation. A is equal to 100,000, the quantity 1, plus 0 0.15 divided by 1 raised to the power of 1 times 1. Or you can just easily say A equal to 100,000 times 1.15. Then you get what you want, which is 115,000 simple <laughs> the formula is quite confusing but you need to pull out the necessary things you need so after one year your money has grown to a hundred and fifteen thousand after two years the new money is now a hundred and fifteen thousand right so and you still earning 15 percent interest but this time around is no longer hundred thousand that you are earning interest on you are now earning interest on the extra 15,000 you earned last year. So now, what's how to calculate it is now A is now equal to 115,000. It's no lo longer 100,000. Then you multiply it by 1.15. Then you get 132,250 Naira. So to calculate the year three, you need to take the new money you already have which is a is now equal to a hundred and thirty two thousand two hundred and fifty naira then you multiply it again with one point one five then when you multiply it like that you will get one fifty two thousand and some coins my dear without doing anything no without doing anything this money is just growing there. So you can imagine if you have 10 million and put it there. <laughs> imagine what will happen. 
So this is how your money will keep growing. And although there is inflation and what the money can buy this year, you may not be able to buy it next year. This is why you need investment that gives you a good rate so that it will be beat inflation. Even though the compound interest is, the thing is compounding, is beating inflation. Mm, mm. You have, <laughs> using your, your money is working for you while you sleep. Now, imagine if you invest 1 million instead of 100,000 for that three years. You see? So instead of 150,000, you'll be getting about 1.5 million, 20,000. About, about that. Then if you do 10 million, hey, you'll be, your interest will grow to at least minimum of, let's say, 5.2 million. That's a whole lot for three years. So in this case, is your capital that is working for you. And then your interest is also working harder. So in fact, I don't joke with compound interest. Let me tell you something. Did you know that billionaires like Warren Buffett, they use this kind of things to grow their wealth? Honestly, they use it for both uh, stock, pension, different investment. This is what they do. So when you keep the money, they keep growing. The secret is to find, make sure that the interest that you got is going to beat the inflation. Don't forget that especially in nigeria where things are increasing every day by day you what you bought with one million naira last year you can't buy it with the same amount this year so it's always important to keep that in mind when calculating when looking into compound interest if you have if you have watched if you have watched to this moment take a minute please just click subscribe button and give the video thumbs up if you like it now i have a challenge for you Take the formula I just showed you, go to this uh, comment section and calculate how much your money will grow in two years and then leave the comment down below. And if you have a question at all about the formula or anything else consigning this video, please leave a comment down below and I'll respond as soon as I can. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe button and I will see you in my next video.